Hi guys, this is Michael I'm bringing you a new segment called Sunday Twitch where I just talk about something I've been thinking about this week uh, and today is about Thomas and I'm going to read you a, a piece of scripture One of the twelve disciples, Thomas was not with the others when Jesus came, so when Jesus came back to life, he visited the disciples, but Thomas happened to not be there. And they told him, we have seen the Lord, but he replied, I won't believe it unless I see the nail wounds in his hands. Put my fingers into them and place my hand into a wound in his side. John 20, verse 24 to 25. So I was thinking that instead of calling Thomas, Darwin Thomas, um, maybe we should call him Rational Thomas or realistic Thomas. Thomas was still heartbroken about Jesus being killed. And now his friend was saying Jesus was alive. The whole thing was too much for Thomas to bear. A baby Thomas thought that the grief of the past few days had caught up with them and had driven them crazy. Uh, maybe he thought they were desperate to continue the movement that Jesus started. Or Maybe, and he would never admit this, but maybe Thomas was hurt that his friends saw Jesus and he, and he missed out. Maybe he felt, he felt left out. Maybe he, maybe he said, I won't believe it. The same way we say, well, I don't want to go to that party anyway after we don't get the invitation and everybody else does. But the beautiful thing, I think, is that for Thomas, it's not enough to see Jesus. He needed to touch Jesus. He needed to feel the wounds that brought him so much sadness. His, his request showed how much he missed his friend. And, and you know, Thomas's skepticism wasn't unreasonable. Yeah, when you're around Jesus, you're used to amazing stuff happening. But this, this was too wonderful to be true. And but I was Thomas, I'd be thinking the same thing. Because Thomas was right. Or at least he should have been right. Dead people just don't walk out of their graves. If we were in Vegas, we put a we put a bet on Thomas. He'd be right ninety nine point nine 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 percent of the time. He'd be right. If the person in Quentin was anyone other 
Then Jesus. Thank you for watching and have a great day.